a visit to Buck Knives' new factory at Post Falls, Idaho. I'm William Hovey Smith, and I'm probably best known for my book, Backyard Deer Hunting, Converting Deer to Dunner for Pennies a Pound. And that's exactly what I do in that book. Well, I use knives and I write about knives. I was invited to go out and visit Buck's new factory in Idaho. Now, they moved from San Diego because they could actually continue to make knives in Idaho, but the economics were against them making knives in San Diego. Well, here's how they keep track. When things are shipped, these cards are put out. And when manufacturing receives the cards, they start a new batch of knives. And here is a sheet being cut out with a laser giving knife blanks. Well, here are some blanks and also some polished blades so you can contrast the two and see how they're coming along. After the blades are blanked, there is some milling done while the steel is still soft, and then it goes through a three-step heat treating process. You have a high heat, then you go into cryogenic cooling, which is what's going on in this freezer chest, and these knives are being quenched in liquid nitrogen. After that, they are annealed, so you have some flexibility restored back to the blade. Now, after this annealing process, they go through testing to make sure that the blade has actually reached hardness levels. Now, after the blades have gone through this far, then you start the serious grinding on putting on the edges and also any fine little finishing that's needed. Uh, they use a hollow ground blade on many buck knives, and this gives a nice good edge. Okay, you got your blades, you got your parts, and here we're putting them together. Uh, these go around in batches from bench to bench. Then finally, uh, they go through the polishing steps, and that's what these gentlemen are doing right here. And they're polishing up the knives to make them nice and pretty. You see in the back polished finished knives. And in the foreground of this tray, knives that haven't finished polishing yet. So you see what they look like. All right. Here is a whole tray filled and ready to be put in individual boxes and shipped. Each knife is individually inspected. Once they get to the shipping department, after each shipment order is received and computer entered, then each knife is put in, checked off on a computer to make sure all the orders are there. Okay, here is C.J. Buck. And he's looking happy because we're going hunting. And he doesn't get out very often anymore. Well, we went bear hunting. And I got a black bear. And here we are with Clint Boone and our Idaho black bear, about an average size one. Took it with a crossbow. And we were to clean it with these buck knives. You see in the top there a gutter and then a skinner. And also a caping knife. So we had all three and we used all three on these black bear on this black bear, and as you see, it did very, very well. Now, I've been using buck knives for years. Now, I actually kill with buck knives, and here I am finishing off a gator by severing its spine with a buck knife. Uh, he's on the ground there, and the knife I use happened to be Buck's buoy, and this is a Master Series buoy, which is a discontinued pattern, and this I use to kill my gators with. All right, well, Buck makes a lot of knives, and these are a bunch of those of the first year's production from Post Falls, and these have a distinctive mark with the outline of the state of Idaho. They do custom knives, as they always have, like these very handsome knives finished out with Mastodon ivory. Now, you can order these from Buck, too. Now, if I've got you sort of inspired to build knives, you know you can do that. Jameson Woodworks makes wooden knife kits that they ship to you, and you can put together with your kit, usually in about an hour, or if you really want to do it yourself. They are really neat. Uh, put them together, and he has five patterns. To go with me on a tour of Buck Knives facility conducted by C.J. Buck, listen to my radio show starting on July the 4th. Now, you can listen to Hovey's Outdoor Adventures from my website, www.hoveysmith.com. Just click on the link below the banner. Now, for information on Jameson's knife kits, go to www.jamesonwoodworks.com. Now, for more about my books, blogs, videos, and cooking, go to www.hoveysmith.com. Good hunting and good eating from the outdoors.